quickly testing the audio and the in-game sounds. Hi guys, welcome back to another episode and I finally found two Ginyu picks. So basically, and I finally have tamed them and you can see that they are level 1. So I think you can also make them sit down. Let's try that out. So that doesn't seem to work. Maybe I need an empty hand. Hmm? Oh, you can put it on your head. So yeah, basically you can put, uh, put the uh, guinea pigs on your head for easy traveling if you want to. And you can also... Uh, what? 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 I'm not sure how you remove them though. Oh, like that. And if, like, for example, you are very far away and they are... Uh, they are not following you the way you want, you can basically, uh, with the right mouse, with the radio, you can put... Uh, recall them back to your head. <laughs> it's kinda weird but anyway I quickly want to test out if you can see the status of the mobs basically with paper you if you press on it you can actually see the status of the Ginyu pick so health 7, power level 1, speed 10 and the more fights they do the higher the level they will be and more power they will have and stuff like that so that's pretty cool and so yeah let's quickly sleep here because I don't wanna don't wanna be at the night. So yeah, let's go into the bed. Anyway, now for to test my other theory is if they will get along with wolves. So yeah, this probably I will lose one of my mobs, but we will see. Also I wonder if they are like the other mobs now that they will basically um uh, Let's see, oh, I can't. I need an empty hand for that. That's kind of annoying, but that's the way it is. Let's see if I attack one mob, will they also attack it now? Because before they only attacked something that was attacking me. So if I hit it this once, are they going to attack him? No, no, they are not. So most of the code isn't from the wolf, which is kind of kind of sucks because then they probably won't get along with the wolf but yeah that's something we have to figure out let's go we got big daddy and sh I don't know how to pronounce that Shaniqua I don't know Shaniqua Shaniqua sounds like Japanese or something <laughs> so yeah let's go back to my house let's see where it is I think it's over here what a piggy Dun, 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 dun. So I wonder how you can train the guinea pigs then, because I don't see a way for them to be training unless there's like real hostiles. But I don't think guinea pig actually can take down a hostile. So that's kind of hard to train them then. But yeah, let's see how they get along with the wolves. I think they might actually kill each other. But if they don't, that's pretty awesome because then you can have like a wolf and a guinea pig army and... That's just freaking awesome. So yeah, let's walk all the way back. I know it's annoying, but... At least we got guinea pigs on our hands now. That's, I've been here like thousand times. So the grass actually went up a few blocks, but it's not even close yet. It's fucking sucks, but yeah. What can you do about it? I wish you could like go, uh, what the heck is going on here? Why is there a workbench here? Makes no sense. Oh well, I'm gonna collect it anyway. I saw a hitchback over there, but I don't have cake, so I can't tame him. Let's 
go over here and let's see how the epic fight will be between the wolves and the guinea pigs because I think they will fight because my guinea pigs also killed my uh, farm animals oh crap this isn't gonna work at least that's not what I think because they are they will get squashed here if I walk here so yeah we have to wait for them uh, maybe I can recall them when uh, once I'm over there yeah probably I can let's try let's try it out yeah alright here goes nothing uh, just in case I'm gonna put one of my let's see if I walk yeah I didn't oh yeah he got damaged so yeah we have to be careful of that then so basically we can uh, recall them here get them off my head quick before they die and basically heal them up again I like that you actually see a health bar now before you did not see them so yeah let's try big daddy with some of the new mobs oh crap he's gonna get squashed I'm sorry man I didn't mean to So yeah, let's get one wolf and let's see what's going on. Here it goes. He doesn't seem too aggressive yet, so it might work. Come on, Wolfie. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Look at him. Alright, here it goes. Actually, they get along. Oh, that's awesome. They are not aggressive on each other. Perfect. This is so awesome, in my opinion. So, yeah, that's actually cool because now you can have like guinea pigs and wolves and all that kind of stuff. And I probably can put them all into one house as well, which is awesome, in my opinion. Let's so go in here. You recall all your hamsters like that. And now you have guinea pigs. Let's get the wolf back in here. Sit down. Get in there. So yeah, uh, let's see. Anyway, this episode I want to start building a new pro project. I'm not sure what I'm going to build yet. Any input would be nice. And I also need to find a way for my har my farm over there for a new use for it because I don't have the baby most installed right now. And I don't know what I'm gonna do with this tower yet. Do you guys think I should blow it up or should I just keep it because... Hey, wait a minute. What? Really? Really? That's sweet, man. There might be more around here. Usually when there's one, there's more. Anyway, I probably have figured out the next episode what I'm going to do. I'm just going to enjoy the landscape for now. Hang out with my pets. And there's two more pets of, of me. Anyway, I'm just going to recall them once I'm in there. That should work like this and I just recall them all and I'm gonna now dismount them and close the door alright so that leaves us with three four five pets awesome anyway I also want to show you guys that I found something here I think I also showed it in another episode but I don't really have a use for it yet so I don't know if I should make it a trap because the drops aren't really that that useful I mean unless you want feathers I don't know what you want to do with feathers though yeah look at that it's a uh, spawner but it only has zombies in there and I don't think zombies are that useful yeah let's try to nuke it with my bombs yeah. Whoa, crap. Alright, that didn't go well. It definitely didn't go well. Let's throw one down there. Got 
got some caves here. Oh, yeah, I also said I was going to do some caving. I guess I could do that now. Get some more uh, resources. At, and I saw some iron over here, so it might be uh, useful to see what we got over here. So I saw some iron here, and it's. I'm gonna collect that because I really need more iron. But yeah, I think I should go to the strip mine because basically there you can get so much more stuff. I got like diamonds there and all that kind of good stuff. Uh, let's quickly see what I'm gonna do. Collect some of this uh, stone. Let's see what we got over here. We got some coal. Always good to have some coal on you. Dead end. So yeah, this cave isn't really that big. Disappointing. But yeah, I think I can also mine when I'm not recording. But I don't really think I have the amount of resources for uh, doing a uh, building project. So that's something I have to look out for. So yeah, we can check the chest for this episode and then I'll probably go and build the next episode. Or mining, depending on what I need. But yeah, for stone we can also use the generator. Which works perfectly. Let's get some of the wool. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, let's see if it still works. As you can see you can, can get the stone pretty quick this way. Uh, sometimes they do fall in lava, which is kind of annoying, but hey, it's free. What do you expect? And actually I was thinking, if you have the pistons mod, basically you can also make it push the stone out of the way, which makes you get a long uh, row, like for, like for example to here, and then you can basically collect all the stone, and then you will have more stone. Let's push this as in the fire. Yeah. Oh my god, that guy is creepy. Doesn't even seem to feel it. Let's quickly head to the bed. I wonder if I can check my stats of my wolves as well now. No, I can't. That sucks, but yeah. Uh, let's see, what are we going to do this episode? Oh yeah, check my resources. Sometimes I even forget what I was going to do. So yeah, if I want to build something, I need a lot of stone. And I don't really have that much stone. Got some staircases. Got some mossy. Not really anything that useful. Let's see how much iron we got in here. Definitely not enough. Got a lot of diamonds though. Let's quickly store all my stuff. So yeah, four stacks of leather. That's also nice. Uh, I've got some black wool. Got some white wool. We got hey white wool. I can make the pathway. Anyway, I'm running out of time for this episode. I hope you enjoyed the episode, even though it wasn't that exciting. Uh, anyway, I will continue in the next episode. Uh, bye!